Hi, this is Preeti from Analytics India magazine and today's segment is a weekly update from the world of data science. Everything from new launches, latest research, cyber threats and events that have happened in the past 7 days will be covered here. So let's get started. Talking about the launches first, China launches AI virtual doll Ling. According to a report, this 3D virtual figure has been decided to showcase the country's soft power and culture. The startup involved Xmove has self-developed full-stack end-to-end AI technology and therefore has opened the process of intelligent characterization from intelligent modeling to artificial intelligence performance animation technology. These technologies are used to drive facial expression, eyes, body and finger movements of the virtual influencer. Coming to the next launch, Zlink launches reconfigurable chip for satellites. The American firm says the chips would be quite helpful for organizations benefiting from the latest software updates as satellites takes years to reach their targeted orbits. Those managing satellites could reconfigure the software and update the vehicle any number of times. Moving on to the next launch, Microsoft launches new tools at Build 2020 virtual conference. Microsoft during its Build Developer Conference has put on a strong emphasis on machine learning along with plenty of new tools and features that the company is going to work on for building more responsible and fairer AI systems both in the Azure cloud and Microsoft's open source toolkits. One of the tools is Interpret Machine Learning launched a while ago and also the FairLearn toolkit which can be used by developers to access the fairness of machine learning models. Microsoft also launches supercomputers to train large AI models in partnership with OpenAI. Microsoft has recently announced that it has built one of the top 5 publicly disclosed supercomputers in the world to train extremely large artificial intelligence models. In some other news, Intel built a chip with a sense of smell. Intel's fifth-generation Loihi chip uses neuromorphic computing to learn faster on less training data than traditional artificial intelligence techniques, including how to smell like a human does, and make accurate conclusions based on a tiny data set of essentially just one sample. The goal is not just to recognize an odor, but to then be able to make human-level generalizations about the odor. If it's an apple, is it red delicious or a granny smith? Is it ripe or rotten? Is it part of a meal that a human might eat or is it poisonous? Moving on, Facebook leverages AI to improve kit safety in Messenger. In an attempt to beat back a rise in scams and other unwanted interactions during the coronavirus pandemic, Facebook today unveiled an AI-powered messenger feature that surfaces tips to help younger users spot malicious actors. The guidelines, which outline steps for blocking or ignoring people on messenger if that becomes necessary, are intended to educate users under the age of 18 about interacting with adults they don't know. In some other updates, NVIDIA researchers propose technique to transfer AI trained in simulation to the real world. In a preprint paper published this week, NVIDIA and Stanford University researchers propose a novel approach to transferring AI models trained in simulation to the real autonomous machines. Robot grasping is a surprisingly difficult challenge. For example, robots struggle to perform what's called mechanical search, which is when they have to identify and pick up an object from within a pile of other objects. Most robots aren't especially adaptable and there is a lack of sufficiently capable AI models for guiding robot hands in mechanical search. In some news related to COVID-19, Behold AI partners with Apollo Hospitals for quick COVID-19 diagnosis in India. Behold AI, the UK artificial intelligence radiology company, announced its partnership with Apollo Radiology International, part of the Apollo Hospitals Group and a leading provider of interpretative and other clinical radiological services on a pilot program using Behold AI's instant triage AI-based chest X-ray technology to quickly triage suspected COVID-19 patients. Coming to the last update, Conflura raises $20 million for automated cyber attack detection, tracking and response. Conflura, a cyber security startup that helps companies autonomously 
Detect and track attacks in real time has raised $20 million in a Series B round of funding led by Icon Ventures. The race comes amid reports that cyber attacks have surged by at least a third during the COVID-19 crisis with bad actors capitalizing on the number of people working from home on unsecured networks. With that, we come to the end of this video. But don't forget to subscribe to Analytics India magazine and follow this segment for everything in the world of data science. See you next week. Bye.